Good morning, this is Tim Ferriss and I'm going to show you in three minutes, because I dislike making breakfast as much as the next person, how to create a low carb, high protein breakfast that will provide high nutrient density and help you to lose weight. And there are only a few things involved. <coughs> there is a container of egg whites. This is Eggology, but you could use egg beaters or any brand. You have organic flaxseed oil. This is Spectrum. Uh, this is an optional ingredient, uh, but any brand will do. Then we have, in this case, Southwest Salsa Mild, which includes black beans, corn, and other things. It has a net of two carbs, two grams of carbs per tablespoon. Then we have just a bit of lemon juice. And the last ingredient is chopped spinach. So this is what we do. The first is just a small container, and you can really use any Tupperware. I like to use smaller containers. Uh, this is probably about 12 to 13 ounces. And I'll, I'll more or less fill this up with spinach because particularly once it's cooked, this will all go down and flatten out. Uh, so that's the first. And stick the top on, leaving a crack on one side. Pretty self-explanatory. And then on with the second container, we're just going to put in uh, about two to three eggs, really. I don't put in too much. About that much. And adding in the salt in the beginning will allow you to use a lot less. And I'll also put in ground black pepper. Uh, this has, in some research, been shown to increase insulin sensitivity, which is a good thing. And there we have it. So put the top on this. We'll stick these in a microwave uh, for high on a total of two minutes. And check on the eggs, since I've used this microwave before, check on the eggs in about one minute. So, I dislike using the frying pan because of the cleanup. It's not that I dislike cooking, but I dislike the cleanup. Therefore, I don't cook. And uh, I've tried every other option. Uh, you have cooking, then you have also going out to eat breakfast, which for me is a pain in the ass because you end up waiting in line and consumes 20, 30 minutes. So, we have this here, and if you're killing time, I tend to have one to two glasses of wine uh, in the evenings, so I can take a uh, swig, a uh, little bit of wine, a little bit of resveratrol for those of you interested in uh, life extension and caloric restriction. Mmm, Ron Bauer Vineyard is one of my favorites. Uh, so I'll have two glasses, maybe a half a glass or a quarter with that sip. And we'll check on the eggs. Still need the time. And uh, what you'll find is that this here, with very little sugar or salt added, uh, will be used to create almost a huevos rancheros with the egg whites, because egg whites are disgusting by themselves. Uh, at least they're very bland. I find them very unappealing. So we need to add something to it. And this is the best solution that I've found. The flaxseed oil is going to be added to the spinach, as will the lemon. Uh, flaxseed oil by itself will make you vomit on your shoes. Uh, you have a couple of options. You can either leave it out. Number two is you can put about one tablespoon, that's 120 calories, onto the spinach. Uh, don't use too much because it has a very strong flavor. Or you can just take it separately with a spoon have one tablespoon, pinch your nose so that you can't taste it as clearly, and that'll deliver a, a pretty healthy dose of omega-3 fatty acids uh, and really fill out the macronutrient profile of this entire meal. So, we have everything ready to go. Put just a just a couple of squirts of lemon, a small dash, very small dash of 
omega-3 for a flaxseed oil. And then we're going to take a fork and uh, whip up the eggs a little bit. And I'll show you what this looks like. And I will usually eat these right out of the containers. I recognize not everyone wants to do that. So. So, mix up the spinach. And if I weren't talking so much and putting it on a plate and explaining, explicating, this would be a lot faster. Alright, guys. For the salsa, again, just eyeballing it, I'll take two, two or three spoons and just mix it right on top of the eggs themselves. And, uh, voila, my breakfast is done. You can see it right there. And if you're feeling particularly ambitious, you can take a container of lentils, open that up, either put it in a separate container or put it on one side with the spinach and you'll have a higher caloric density if that's what you're looking for. This is probably with the flaxseed oil included somewhere between two and three hundred calories. I am not a big proponent of huge breakfasts so I'll start small and I'll have another meal in uh, two hours or so which will be my main meal after a workout. So there you have it, the roughly three minute breakfast, very little cleanup involved. Enjoy Lose some fat, gain some muscle, be good.